Hi, I'm Eric Wong. I'm here at IDF 2014. We're here in the Superspeed USB community where Synopsys is demonstrating our 10 gigabit per second USB 3.1 on apps platforms. And uh, I'm here with Jeff Ravencraft. Jeff, uh, you're uh, in charge of USB at the USB IO. What, uh, what, what's new? It's a lot of great things, exciting things happening here at IDF. We're really uh, driving, uh, uh, delivering a single cable solution uh, over USB that includes performance for uh, 10 gigabit per second, power up to 100 watts, and a robust yet very user-friendly cable and connector scheme with the USB Type-C connector. I see, I see. So tell us a little more about performance. Where and, and uh... Well, performance uh, with, 10, with 10 gigabit per second, your synopsis is showing the first IP support for um, uh, 10 gigabit per second. Uh, we have uh, also uh, first silicon, both for host and device, that we're demonstrating here. So uh, a lot of excitement around performance to drive um, very high end, not only super fast uh, data transfer, but enabling uh, high end devices, not only uh, 4K displays, but also uh, higher end devices connected through hubs, etc. So performance is a big piece. Power at up to 100 watts. Now we can power everything from small cell phones all the way up to large HD displays and everything in between. And you can even use that for charging, I believe. Fast oh, charging. absolutely, faster charging. And then with the Type C connector, um, we had three key things there that drove the development of Type C, which was for these emerging smaller platforms, the standard A is too big. The micro B is great for phones, but not robust enough for tablets or PCs. And then the user was also struggling with how to plug the, the USB connector in. So those three items were really the driving factors defi behind defining a new Type-C connector. A lot of excitement around Type-C. A lot of excitement around Type-C and the combination of being able to deliver 10 gigabit per second data rate and the power all simultaneously over a single connector. One cable for everything. One cable, one connector. So what, uh, what's, uh, what do you feel like the time frame is? What is, what is the thought? The industry is moving very fast uh, on all of these three fronts. Uh, we're anticipating seeing all of these technologies enter the market in early 2015. Early, early 2015, that's yeah. just a few months away from yeah. us. Great, Jeff, thank you so much for uh, meeting with us again. I really appreciate Eric, it. it. It's always a pleasure to be here with Synopsys. We appreciate the opportunity to be here with you. So thank have, you. Enjoy your week, thanks. All right, thank you.